so beautiful to see when the commodities indices or any instrument trade and behave as expected as predicted i have told you very clearly beyond 3.2 levels stay bullish in natural gas we are looking forward to 3.5 and 3.6 in just couple of sessions natural gas has given you more than 10 percent of profits i hope you all profited here while look at crude oil we have been also bullish in oil here and see what it has done it has moved towards the next resistance zone at 70.4 70.6 because beyond this we know that the next targets are towards 71.4 and 72.5 levels what to expect now from the u.s session from oil and gas the storage data natural gas might bring little volatility as it has seen a little a stronger rise it can reverse as well and now how to profit trading crude oil wti and natural gas today we will see with the help of charts and indicators we'll do a multi time frame analysis and arrive at the levels at which you can take a trade trade with profit trade with logic trade with confidence subscribe press the bell icon this is the only channel in the world to give you two updates a day for crude oil and natural gas with precision do join the free telegram channel for live market updates and do join the channel memberships here on youtube to support the effort let's start first crude oil followed with natural gas watch now look at crude oil what did we discuss earlier in the day that it has formed a base rise here and see it is delivering higher lows higher highs now this is a nice flag here and it has come towards the next resistance zone at 70.4 70.6 it is very very important for oil to now trade beyond 70.4 70.6 zone which is a confirmation of a stronger move ahead which is going to take it towards 71 71.4 and 72.5 72.6 zone this zone is definitely critical first resistance at 70.4 70.6 stochastic macd rising and rsi is back to overbought levels here on the early charts coming to two look at the formation rise and then this channel here flag formation wait for a breakout here this breakout can lead to a stronger rise else uh, right now at this point the reversal cannot be denied yes if it reverses from here trades below 70 we can expect more bearishness and now the support levels are limited towards 69 and 68.8 while the median support is at 69.5 69.6 zone stochastic overbought the macd has crossed over again for the buys the rsi is at the top here on the three hour charts when you see similar observation here uh, taking the support from the 20 period it is bounced back the moving average is crossing over here making it a very good support and a good bullish sign is this so uh, bearishness ideally in oil is only and only if it trades below 69 68.8 stochastic rising the macd has crossed over trying to rise rsi is rising here on the four hour charts when you see similar observation see a bit of consolidation first of all look at this strong bullish move sideways movement breakout wait for it to trade beyond 70.4 70.6 and then the bulls are here we are looking forward to a top here which can in fact take it beyond 72.6 and 73 levels because beyond this we are waiting for 74.575 stock i stick back to overbought macd rising rsi rising here coming to the day now before we look into the daily charts if you want to learn this art of trading join my mentorship batch and if you just want to trade as per the signals be a part of my signals channel on telegram connect with me write an email ping me over telegram for your queries and if you're looking forward to a broker which offers you a safe free account with lowest spreads and no hidden charges and easier transactions and easier withdrawals from across the globe you can find the recommended broker link also in the channel and video description now see so far oil on the daily charts has been trading bearish i have mentioned one thing here look at this the support levels it is formed very very strong the triple bottom is an indication that we may see a rise but see what is happening here uh, first of all uh, you can find out a good base a strong candle couple of consolidation or retracement candles now breaking out here so now once it stays beyond 70.6 ideally what we are looking at first at 71.5 and then in fact 72 72.6 and beyond this beyond this there is a slight gap left at 74.5 75 which it may try to fill if not today some point of time very soon in the near future stock i stick back to overbought look at the macd what did we discuss earlier in the day drop retracement double bottom a crossover leads to a stronger rally here be mindful of this because once it breaks beyond 72.5 this time i am looking forward to 74.575 and once it stays above 74.575 the next targets are too high too far 
RSI rising here. So looking at this, at least for the day, now you have to be cautious. See, prices can still reverse. These are markets. Anything and everything is possible. But I will recommend you to only buy if you see it is staying above 70.4, 70.6 zone, which is a crucial, crucial resistance here for oil. Because breaking beyond which you can target for 71, 71.5, and then 72.4, 72.5 very, very soon, if not today. Very clear. On the downside, the selling entries ideally are limited only below 69, but these are far below levels. So you can take a selling entry at 69.7, expect 69.4, 69.5 as the first target, 69.2, 69 as the second, and then 68.7, 68.8. If at any point of time, if you see oil trading below 68.7, 68.8, stay short stay short for what stay short for 68 chances for such a strong reversal appears to be less here take your positions accordingly let's move to natural oh my favorite natural gas what a good move here it is showing and i've mentioned see once natural gas starts the move it is not going to stop and i will show you something on the daily charts let's come to the daily charts so i have mentioned here double bottom i have mentioned here once it breaks out beyond 3.2 this time we are looking at 3.5, 3.6 and these are the levels we had seen in the last year, almost more than a year back. We have seen such levels and almost a year back, it is back to these levels here. Now see the formation here, what's happening? I will come back to the daily charts later. First, let's have a look at the early charts. See on the early charts, rise, consolidation, rise, consolidation and a strong move here. Now if you connect the dots, you will find it has been trading in this channel. Where are the lows of the channel towards 3.49, 3.48 zone, which is a good support, then 3.45 and then below that 3.4. If and only if you see natural gas trading below 3.4 today, you can say that it is turning bearish. And yes, this is possible. The storage data can reverse the complete trend. Why? Because it is highly overbought. But right now I will say, I will still say, uh, natural gas is willing to move towards 3.6 and those who follow me for long I have been advocating a rise in natural gas at least to six dollars at least to eight dollars and higher levels in the near future let's see if this is one of the good bullish breakouts here it is right now trading bullish trading with divergence from the 20 period which is a good sign for the bulls but again this calls for a little retracement as well a stochastic overbought MACD is at extremes. It is not that it cannot rise further. We have seen it trading bearish for months and years. Now this rally can sustain here for a while. RSI overbought as well. Coming to two hour charts, similar observation on the two hour charts. Formed a very good base at 3.4. Then again a run. We have to wait. We have to wait for it to break here. Uh, ideally, you can wait for 3.5 levels to be taken where you can take a selling entry. Expect 3.47, 3.45 as the first target zone and 3.4 as the next chances for which appears to be less the stock has take overbought MACD rising RSI overbought so yes things are getting overbought here for natural gas but this is the beauty with natural gas that once it starts to run it does not stop and uh, yes whether it is on the sell side we have seen it crashing hard for multiple months where we have seen it eroding almost 20, 30, 50 percent in a couple of months or more. So this cannot be an another ex exception that it can keep on rising from here. Moving average is looking up versus stock. The observation is more or less same on the three hour charts here. And here also the stock I stick the MACD and RSI all are staying overbought here. But this is the beauty of natural gas. It can stay here with this momentum for a while. But I am worried about the natural gas storage data today, which can bring light uh, slight fluctuation, slight volatility here. Now look at the four archers. Diminishing bullishness is one part. Straight bullishness is second part. This is the channel. Where is the lows of this channel towards 3.45? And a reversal confirmation is only below 3.4, 3.38, where you can say that it is turning bearish. What is happening here? Rise, rise, retracement, rise, retracement, rise, retracement. And now a breakout, breakout from 3.2. And that is what we had seen, we had expected and we have predicted. And now it has come to a resistance zone. So if you see it now, it's staying about 3.56. You can stay bullish for 3.6. Stochastic overbought, MACD rising, RSI overbought here. Coming to now, look at the daily charts. Yes, as I have expected, as I have shown you, uh, see this run, then sideways movement, double bottom, a breakout here. This is the second bull run here, and this time it is going to stay here for a while. In fact, you can also expect 3.6 and 
four dollar levels very very soon then there is the next gap at 4.4 which is also going to get filled very very soon now if you look at it, it is it is putting pressure on the bands to expand this is the second consecutive bullish candle i do not expect natural gas to trade below 3.4 today and thus if you see it around 3.4 3.42 you can buy it again and for the day ideally i will not recommend you to sell but yes this is getting slightly overbought and thus you can take a 3.5 to expect 3.5 3.47 3.45 is the next and then 3.4 is the third so if you are selling at 3.5 to you 4 5 to you have to be extremely cautious this can reverse this can rally again and you will take a hit here and thus the cells are to be with caution at least as long as it respects 3.45 below 3.45 is where slight bearishness towards 3.4 can be seen below 3.4 3.38 is where the bears are waiting and then extreme crash can be seen chances for which appears to be less on the upside i will recommend a buying entry at 3.56 expect 3.6 as the first target 3.635 as the second and 3.68 as the third target and beyond this ideally we are waiting for 3.8 and 4 dollar levels very very soon Take your trades accordingly, like, share, subscribe and comment, join my mentorship badge, join my signals channel, reach out to me for your queries. Do like, share, subscribe and comment. Do not miss to watch every day the first update with the US session, uh, Asia session and Europe session. Thus join the free telegram channel for live updates, join the channel memberships. Thank you, have a great profitable trading day.